Hey, hello everyone, Pally Time here. Welcome back to Elden Ring. Let me guess, he's not dead. No, no, of course not. We are in the great frozen north trying to find our path. We have a rough plan for where we're trying to go, and it's that bowl right there. I don't... Am I going to climb into the bowl? I don't know. But a lot of paths seem to be climbing up the same direction. I also equipped a new... Whoa, he went right over my head. I also equipped a new talisman that should be giving us some mana back whenever we kill a target. I was hoping that if we... I got this from one of the spirits from that big giant deer we killed, actually. Hopefully the mana return is enough to fund all of the dashing I could ever want to do. That's the plan. Wait, he's not actually dead? What do we get back? It seems like it's okay. It seems like it, it's okay. This is the Ancestral Horn. Restores FP upon defeating foes. I was hoping we could get into a situation where, like, I have infinite sustain as we're going through trash mobs. That's what I was trying to do, anyway. I'm not seeing the bar move. Am I just blind? I mean, I am glancing around at other things, to be fair. We are paying attention to the road and my surroundings, but it's certainly not... Certainly not a very big gain. Not a very big gain. Oh, you're coming out of the ground. There was a ruin nearby that we could take a look at, and I believe we're actually pretty close. I'm paying attention. Oh yeah, it jumps a little bit. It's like a free dash every time I kill an enemy. I mean, that'll add up over time. I'm trying to be optimistic. It seems like it's really low. Do we want to look at this ruin? How far down is it? Oh, that's not a ruin at all. That's not even a ruin a little bit. That's a whole keep. Hold on, I'm seeing something on the top floor here. What am I seeing? What is that? Oh! It's a big knight. And another one over there with two dogs. Yeah. That place uh, is much more fortified than I initially thought. Oh, why? Oh, that's how this day's going to go, huh? It's Y to close the menu, not B to close the menu, guys. God, come on. Get with the times. Okay, so, so far this just seems like it. it's a pretty expansive graveyard. Did I just hear the bell? Did the undead bell just toll? Ah, uh, indeed it did. Oh, that's also a big dong, too. <laughs> Both things are true. Bro, you might actually be able to get into this castle by jumping on that tower there. I do see a grace out front. I'm gonna stick to my plan, though. You guys are just coming out of the fucking ground? That was supposed to be a big jump scare, wasn't it? Oh! Oh my god! Ah! What the fuck? Okay, you got me a little bit. Alright, you got me a little bit. Keep riding, Torin! We're almost free! Oh, I don't feel good about going in a straight line. I don't feel good about going in a straight line. All right. Hey, progress. We did it. Immediately to our left, bats. Okay, we've made it across one bridge. This was a ruin I wanted to look at. But then there's another bridge that goes across right by the fucking tree. This one's a dead herd tree, though. I wonder if that'll actually have any significance. Um. Hey. 
We've been fighting bats the entire game. How hard could a bat be? Oh, actually, not that bad. Oh, okay. I mean, he hit kind of hard, but I, I feel like, you know, everything just kind of hits kind of hard. Let me get out of his way. You know what? Change that. Let's jump right onto him. Was that a whistle? What did I just hear? Oh my god, not having any reach is starting to get to me. Here we go, main weapon out. And I'm still missing! Did, did I just hear a deer? Is that all I heard? That kind of looks like an old church. Hey, little bud, you're okay. Stop whining. <laughs> okay, this looks good. Um, we've seen a few ruins like this where there have been spots with illusionary walls on the floor, but I think there's too many pillars here for that. So far, I mean, these seem completely where did you go? abandoned. Hello? You promised me when we turned 14, we go to see the stars. I feel like I have a picture of is I've been waiting ever so long. Forever and ever it seems. Is this voice actress in Choppy? Examine. Held shut by a seal. Where did you go? Well, chat told me what to do, so I guess I'm going to do it. We have a fancy spin emote. And locked behind the door. Primal Glintstone Blade. Spells consume less FP, but maximum HP is reduced. Our current HP is uh, 1,400. Let's top off. Let's top off. I'll just drink my Physic. Why not? So 1,402. If we equip the new Talisman, that goes down to... Ooh, 1,191. So we lost about 200 HP, a little bit more than that. I wonder how much of a difference that actually makes. Like, how much less does it consume? This place just kind of feels like a pit stop on the road now. There we go. We're hitting some attacks. This is illusionary, right? No! Yo, White Bat with that breath attack hit pretty hard. And I did need some more freezing grease, so I'm not too upset. Well, back on the path. Okay. This should be fairly straightforward, right? Are we going to get some orange dudes coming out of the ground? Mything stone. Nine. We need a ten. Wherever tens come from. That's the path we walked past with all of the, the fire worshippers. Is just what I assume they are. Let's see if we can peek a little higher up the hill here. I wonder if all of the shaders coming into focus on these guys was a clue. They may just be set pieces, but I wonder if a few of these big... They look like giants or 
Not quite gargoyles because they don't have the wings. So I'm going to go with giants. Trolls have that cavity in their chest. I don't know if these guys do. Oh, it's a demi-human captain. And more demis to the right. How do I get up there from here? We're going to have to go... I'm not sure. Oh, just missed. Oh, he didn't though. Ouch. Chill, my dude. It's not going to go well for you if you keep screaming. I mean, there's really not a situation where it does go well for you. So this is the dead Erd tree then on the map. It's just one of the miners, but we've come across a lot of minor earth trees that were absolutely bustling with life. Actually, usually these things have a stray, a stray, a stray demon protector. Glad to see this one is no different. We've never fought a stray demon with our claws before. Let's give it a go. Stay behind him. Out in. Oh, stamina. Stamina is so drained. Stamina very drained. We can just skirt this one. We'll be fine. Well, wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. That's the real one. Fuck! Man, there's... I hope there's a statue nearby because I haven't seen a grace in a really long time. I was trying to see if the other one that he summoned didn't have the same amount as of HP, but I couldn't see the health bar. Motherfucker, that's a long run. Oh, did I go to another bridge? I did. So how do we get across? I'll figure that out after we beat up the boss. We'll figure it out. Let me get my roots real quick, please. Uh, I'm gonna go for big old staggers instead. Look at that hold. Oh God! Uh, that's not where I wanted to be. Fuck! We got the dodge. Weapon art, follow up. Stay in. Damn. I was, oh, I gotta go. I was really expecting to get a stagger there. I hit this guy really hard. I think a real one is in the back. Gotta go. Now. Separate him again. We're real ones in the back. It's on the left. We might just be able to end this. Do they share a health pool? I think I clipped... I think I clipped the one that I thought was just an illusion. I saw some extra damage happen on that weapon swing. Looks like we passed the statue. Yeah, this is one of the summoning statues. This isn't one of the checkpoint ones. Which is odd, because normally when there's an open world boss, they give you a checkpoint. Maybe it's because that grace is actually pretty close. Well, that's convenient for our uh, souls to be right here. Nice immunity, weapon art again. Nice immunity, weapon art again. Out of stamina. He's summoning his friend. Let's just wait for him to group up. We'll hit them both. Or not. Fuck. Hey, that's fine. That's not fine. We did get the heal, though. Light of sight, light of sight. I don't think this will work! Ah! 
Whoa! 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 All right, you guys hold on a second. Other Deb, can you help me out here? Ouch! I'm gonna get away. Line of sight behind the tree and drink. I'll fight this one. Other Deb can fight the other one. Bullshit! Bullshit that hit me! Other Deb! No! I think I'm safe here. Good job, Other Deb! Keep it up, you're doing great! Carillion Crystal Tear, a Crimson Bubble Tear. Oh, are those for our physics? That's something I want to pay a lot more attention to on Edward's playthrough. Is different physic combinations. Holy crap. So after all that, oh, that's our path around. Okay, okay, yeah, that works. There's no bridge. I thought we'd be on a bridge. But we could just take this over. Uh, let me go level up real fast. <laughs> Other Jeb's job, job description. Get hit in the face as much as possible. <laughs> yes. Other Jeb's, Other, De Other Deb's job description. Make them mad so I can run away. I'm gonna follow this around. See if any paths become more clear. This doesn't look anywhere near possible. But if that connects to the low ground, can I just climb up from the shore here? I thought that was all cliff face. Oh no, I think I see one of the Kaled monsters. Oh, uh, yep. Yeah. Yeah. That's probably why all these barricades are set up. <gasps> Son of a bitch! So that's the cave we've already explored. Let's stay really close to the wall. But this is looking like a sheer cliff. Okay, so this is with the church behind us. Uh, this looks like it leads up into the mountain. Oh, yep. Yeah. And, oh, yep. Yeah. And more Caleb beasts. Oh, yep. Yeah. Good. I think I'm going to have to walk across this chain to our left. That's the one we saw walking around to our right. I'm sure they won't attack me when they see I'm not a beast. Oh, these are the flame worshippers. Oh, and this guy looks like he's down to fuck. Oh, no. Uh, uh, opening in the building. Where was that chain? Where was the chain? Chain's still ahead of me? Well, that building looks kind of cool. Wait, I just saw something moving here. What did I see? What did I see? <gasps> Is that a giant moving around? He just broke a tree in half. I'm gonna check out this place. Hopefully there's grace inside. And we can just have a nice little sit down. Are you fucking kidding me? Where were you? So what happened there is I summoned in other Deb. So that took 50% of my HP. And right at that moment, I was also hit for the other 50% of my HP. 
at the exact fucking moment. Really unlucky, actually. They must have been chasing me. Oh, there's Grace here. We're finding him. We're not doing that bad. Main weapon classifies as a curved sword. Correct. Uh, curved great sword, I think. Lord Contenders. Well, I got to be honest. That's not super inspiring. Not, not super inspiring. We're also going to need to swap out some stuff here. I'm going to go for. I'm going to double dip on stamina. Yeah. Yeah. All right. What do you got? Uh, a round table knight vike. Should I know who this is? Jeez. Oh! What? Come on, get out of here. Of course, there's a wall right behind me. Whoa! What the fuck? Do you again? I disagree. Woo! Luckily, I can actually back away from him really easily with the claws. We're back. We're out. We're out. We're out. Top off my mana too. We're just gonna use our mobility to my benefit. Oh! Big out. Physic. None of that. I think he almost staggered me there. Every time he, he just drank. Ah! Ah! I'm too far. We're out. Wonder if he has any more drinks. Oh, that's unlucky. We're out. Let's hit him with the big one. You gonna drink again? Shit. Okay. I think we saw most of his stuff there. It didn't seem like there was a phase two because he drank. It also seems like his health is actually pretty low. The problem is when I'm dueling him with the great curve blade, with the bloodhound blade, he's kind of matching my tempo a lot. Where I see his opening, I go for an attack, he dodges that attack and then sees my opening and then tries to counter me. However, the claws allowed me to move around him quite a bit. I wonder if we can... Oh, we just have fire grease. I feel like our, we're kind of lacking in the grease department at the moment. Might need to try to fix that soon. Um, If we hit him with the big sword, he's going to take huge chunks of health. But if we go after him with the claws, we're a lot safer. Um, I, I might try some fire. I mean, I feel like someone out here, their frost resistance would be pretty high. I mean, he has been locked in jail, so who knows? Uh, we're also going to start with a big old charged attack here. So that second attack there, he does that three poke combo. 
I tried rolling out of that combo this time and it worked, I think twice. That time it caught me just because I rolled straight back instead of to the side. That same combo locks me out of using the dash on the claws. So literally I have to roll out of that to the side because if I try to dash, there's not enough time. I can't do this. Uh, however, I am going to start with this weapon buff. I see how that attack works now. It makes like a cross. This is three hit. This is jump. Nice. Just straight up bullied him that time. Bro, it paused so long I thought we were about to fight something else. Vikes Dragon Bolts. Okay, fine. I won't read it. Mm, incantation. Yeah, Vikes Dragon Bolt. Uh, summons a red lightning to bolster both the caster's body and their armament held in their right hand. Enchants armament with lightning affinity attacks that increases maximum equipment load. <laughs> what? <laughs> However, lightning damage negation is reduced. Why would a lightning spell also increase your equipment load? Imagine doing a build where you fat roll until you buff your weapon and then you start rolling around like crazy. Iron armor, singed and blistered by fingers, worn by Vike, Knight of the Round Table. No other tarnished was closer to the throne of the Elden Lord than Vike. But without announcement, Vike traveled far below the capital and was scorched by the flame of frenzy. Did he make this choice for his maiden, or did some other forces lure him with suggestion? Vike's armor looks sick from this, from, from right here. Um, oh, his helmet looks kind of melted as well. He's a pretty cool dude. So no one ever got closer than him, huh? It seems like we're getting pretty close then. Next episode, we'll check out what's in this fort and see if we like it. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. See you again next time.